Hi everyone, Lucy, and today I'm going to bring you guys some more Rust. It's been a while since I've played it, or at least like on the, you know, normal version of Rust. I played some Battle Royale like a month ago. Not too many people were interested enough for whatever reason, but yeah. The series which I made on this, well this series right now, I don't know what series it actually is, but it was uh, it was pretty good. I had a lot of fun recording it. I did play it with a bunch of people. It's been a fuck ton of updates, and I think you guys enjoyed it too. So I'm going to be trying to revive the series. Uh, if no one watches these videos, then that's okay. I guess I just won't play it anymore. But if they do, well, then I have a wonderful, it's not really wonderful, it's really shit. But I've got a decent base set up. Um, some, some basic supplies, you know, a pistol, a long sword and uh, the ability to kill everyone that I see so I'm pretty much gonna um, just build up this base try to find some people maybe who are friendly eventually I might play with some more people but right now it is just me and that is pretty much that I don't really have um, too much stuff I just got a few furnaces some supply boxes of stuff inside of them I need to put the pillows up I just got my beds down as well um, so yeah we're just gonna go out and go try to find someone to murder and then uh, we'll be back in a second and and see what we can do with this beautiful base. And I can't get out the door somehow. There we go. If you wonder what these things are around our base as well. These are... Oh my god. These are newly added in this update. They are wood. But don't worry. They are actually very strong. You'll see we've got 750 hit points. They are wooden barricades. Which you can kind of connect together. And you can see we've got um, the barbed wire at the top. So if anyone tries to put a you know some ladders on top of those. Then they obviously can't get over the wall. Uh, there is a bit of a security issue. In our base, which I just realized now. I don't know how it took so long, but you can just put ladders on the front gate. Um, I don't know how I didn't realize this earlier, but I will be adding some barbed wire also here, I think. So that should hopefully, uh, you know, solve that issue. But other than that, our base has got that entirely around it. And yeah, I am playing on my own server. So again, if you want to check out this server and come play with me or come stream, well, not stream snipe me, but come. Is that a dude right there? Yeah, it's a dude right there. Yeah, if you want to come, um, you know, attack my base or whatever, then the IP is in the description below. So come and attack me, do whatever the fuck you want. I really don't care. And yeah, I think that's pretty much it for the base. Let's go hunt some people. I'll try to. I also got a pumpkin, so that's nice. In fact, I'm going to put it on my head. Nice. So yeah, I do need to get some basic supplies. There's an airdrop right there. Actually, it's not too far. It's maybe worth getting that, but eh. I don't want to stray too far with my base. But I just need to get some basic supplies, like some more cloth, some more wood, some more stone. I don't have enough uh, wood right now to keep my furnaces up and running, but I do have a small amount of ore in there already, which is smelling as we are out hunting the enemy. So, yeah. I just need to get some... Well, pretty much every supply I come across, except wood, because there's way too much wood, wood to get in the entire world. And is that dude right there now? I don't know if he's there. Yeah, there he is right there. So, I don't know if he's, like... Well, I don't know. Is this, like, his base or something over there? I guess I'll find that in a second. But, yeah, I'm just going to go over and see what's going on. I don't have too much ammo right now. I've only got this much. But since the new update makes it so that it's much harder to get assault rifles and whatnot, um, I don't think my semi or my pistol is too bad at all. I hear someone said the base. I'm really scared. I feel like I'm going to get Shrek and I'm going to cram myself to sleep. Because I've got everything on this right now. And I don't have too ver uh, too good armor. Like, all I had that I could craft is this t-shirt and these jeans. Oh, you just opened up a door somewhere. So I need to try to catch these guys off guard, hopefully. Oh no, this is a terrible start. I killed some guy who's got really good loot, but the thing is, his friend's in the base right now, and I'm going to bleed out in a second. So this is, this is bad, this is really bad. I didn't think these guys would have SMGs, but it looks like this is a problem with playing by yourself. You tend to get fucked, so I'm going to have to start from the ground up and try to do something again, because I'm going to get killed here. It was kind of a dumb idea to even try to kill someone who's got a Tommy gun when I've got a fucking pistol, but you know. Come on, one more second, I should be up. No, I'm dead! Oh fuck, I might have, I thought I might have revived there. Okay, well, we are going to start from nothing. Um, I spent a decent amount of time making that shit, so I'm kind of salty now, but whatever, we'll just start with nothing and... Uh. Alright, at least we've got some fucking enemies to set up base, that's something, I guess. Alright, so I'm amount of a plan, I can't get that thing right there right now, but... Yeah, what I'm going to do, basically, is I've got a bit of cloth left over in one of my boxes, so I'm going to make a, um, a crossbow. 
And I'm just gonna try to sneak up on someone and kill them. Oh my god, I'm almost getting killed by my fucking own spikes. But yeah, I'm gonna try to sneak up on someone and try to kill them, I think. That's not like the worst idea ever. Uh, I've got enough metal fragments in there right now to make it. And we'll try to work from there. So we need 25 cloth, 75 metal fragments, and 350 wood. So we can go ahead and craft that right now. Kaboom! And this, I don't actually still know if it's better than the, the normal bow. But, you know, it looks pretty cool, doesn't it? So I'm going to go ahead and get some ammo for this as well, which is 25 wood and 10 stone. So I can't actually get any ammo. Shit, okay. This is a problem. Right, we need to go out and go get some more, um, some more stone then, I guess. Yeah, some, oh no, I've got stone in here, actually. So I can just go ahead and get a stone out here. Got so much stone, as you can see. And then we can go ahead and craft... 58 of these, wow. Well, let's craft all of them then, because we're going to be uh, we're gonna be doing a lot of hunting, right? So I'll just put the arrow in. Kaboom. Alright, we're good to go now, boys. I just need to like learn how to use this like a fucking expert. And am, I, am I a girl? Oh yeah, I'm a girl. I mean, I don't know why I asked if I'm a girl. Like, I'm clearly a girl. Wonderful. This thing right here could have saved my life as well. If I had a fucking bandage, like holy shit. I could have really helped out a bit. Really helped out a bit, yeah. Alright, stick that in there. Oh my god, I've got- literally this is all I've got inside my entire box. I've got some wood, I've got that, and that is literally it. So I'm gonna have to go and get some- get myself some armor quickly. Well, not some armor, but I need some kind of clothes. I need metal fragments for fucking jeans, are you serious? Alright, well we're gonna go and get ourselves some jeans again then. I don't think I used those last time, but there we go. And that's- yeah, that's why I got confused. Okay, so we just need 50 cloth for that. And I say just 50 cloth, but that is quite a lot of cloth. So there we go. We've got the same attire back on again. Ready to do something this time with our life, hopefully. Um, and then you go, I don't know, whatever, we'll just fucking go for an adventure. I am kind of close to the, um, the airfield, which is good, so, yeah. Fucking once. LAPD on the floor. I think he's running. You son of a bitch! No, I'm oh, kidding. What? It's Lewis. Oh, Who the fuck's Lewis, Lewis dude? Uh, you want to revive me, friend? I mean, I'd love to, but like, I'm in poverty hey, right now. Hair looks kind of interesting. What? Well, you can take. You can take. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna take your shit, man. I need your shit, dude. Okay. All right, you have a good night now. Okay, bye. Alright boys, see? This is exactly what wanted to happen. We killed a 12 year old, got a fucking revolver, and he's going for puby and shit. Isn't that good? That's well good. It's not good that he's going for puby, you know, hard time. Uh, let's go ahead and have a look at our map as well, so we can work out where this guy's- Oh, Okay, that didn't work. Let's see where this guy came from. So he came from the east. I don't know. I don't think that means anything, but we're gonna keep the map handy just in case. And we now have a revolver and a decent amount of ammo. I'm definitely not gonna go back to that base I was just at, because those guys seem kind of decked. Um, but, we have some decent looking clothes now, I think. Oh, look how camoed I am. Making progress. So we're gonna go drop this stuff off into my base, and then we will go move out. We need to really put the fortification up front as well, but I think I'm just gonna find a barrel eventually, and find, like, a, you know, metal barricade, and then put the metal barricade up on the, uh, the front door, just as I planned earlier. So our base should be, uh, shit, but, you know, it could be worse, I think. And don't worry, by the way, boys, I didn't pay that 12-year-old to die for me. I know it's not a believable story, it seems really scripted, you know, I paid the 12 year old off, he's a big fan, but I didn't, I promise. And, it, you know, we are on a side syndicate server after all, so, what can you expect? There's gonna be a few people who are like, oh no, it's fucking Lewis, mate! So, yeah, we're gonna drop off all the shit, we're gonna put down this thing right here, which is the research table, I think, or I don't know which, yeah, it's a research table. So, we can go ahead and research stuff here, which is good. Um, and then the map's fucking useless, drop off some of this. I don't think I need the bow anymore, we sh- eh, no, I'll keep the bow, actually. And then we'll just drop off this other shit we've got, and I don't know, I don't really have that much stuff, honestly. I need to get some meat. I need to get some meat, and we'll put that in that corner right there. Okay, so that's looking okay now. And we do also have enough wood. I don't know why I didn't do this earlier, but I've got enough wood to uh, cook some more of this. Yeah, I realized why I didn't actually, um, I didn't uh, need to put any more wood in already. Because I don't actually have that much ore. Like, I guess I could put, like, another five, 500 or so in. And I'll get that done, but the, um, the sulfur's been smelled now, and that's inside my box, so... Yeah, I've used pretty much all my metal fragments, and the rest is in there, so... I've got so much metal fragments, but I'm gonna go ahead and, um, get myself the... Uh... Get myself a building plan, which I need paper for. So we get the paper, and then we're gonna build the front, the front thing, just so for now people can't get in too easily. Because obviously wooden ladders, bitches love wooden ladders. 
Right, there we go. So I'm going to go ahead and build this. So I'm just going to build a floor right here. I mean, it's not the best idea ever, but it'll keep us alive, I guess. And we should have a bit more stone in here, right? I think I've got some stone in here. Yeah, I've got some stone in here. And then we can build this here. So, I don't know. I don't think I've got enough stuff to build the barricades. Or do you even have a blueprint for barricades? I don't know, because I haven't played in so long. No, all I've got is landmines. So I need to find the, the blueprint or find it from a box and put the barricade up on the front of there. Otherwise, that's not going to work too well. And people are going to get in. But yeah, I think I should be good for now. Let's see if we can make this jump as well. I'm kind of curious. Uh, we can. Okay, I mean, I lost a bit of HP there, but whatever. That's a useful jump to know, so I can do a fucking quick escape in my base and look really, really MLG. Okay, so let's try to find some barrels. Uh, maybe Rad Town. I know Rad Towns currently don't actually have any radiation in them, so it's not a bad idea to hit up one of those. And uh, maybe murder another person as well, if we're lucky. Oh shit, I'm fucking beside these guys again. Okay, I didn't realize how, how I got here, but... Yeah, I'm gonna get shrek again, but my base is right there, and I'm on top of these guys' base. Which is probably bad. Alright, let's go, boys. Alright, we're in. This is the fucking dumbest idea ever. I'm literally locked inside here now. We've got a large furnace here. I'm so fucking dead. Why am I? I don't know. I thought this place would actually have a way out. I mean, I can destroy a box, and if you destroy a box when everything falls out, out of it, you can see it's got a cool lock on it. Um, but yeah, I'm just hoping they come inside here. I can't seem to get inside there. I don't know why. I can slash home so I can get back to my home, but I don't know. I kind of want to stay here just so I get to know these guys a bit better. Oh my fucking god. What the fuck? Holy shit. Okay, this is interesting. Um, what's this? A campfire down here. Okay, um, I mean, if I make it out of this alive, and that's good. I could just actually slash, slash home right now. I mean, I don't see any issue with it. If I just go slash home side, then I'm going to teleport to my home, and I just stole all their shit. Like, I don't know. That's, like, a lot of fucking high-quality mail ore. Um, a decent amount of bars. Like, I don't know. Hello? Is anyone here? Friendly, friendly. Friendly, friendly, friendly. Well, yeah, GG, boys. I gotta fucking stole all your shit. I don't know if that's kind of abusive. I wouldn't say it is. I mean, you shouldn't fucking leave your house open. End of story. So, I mean, how, how much shit is this? This allows me to make a, a custom SMG, probably some ammo. Like, I've got a fuck ton of ore now as well. A lot of wood. Oh, I didn't take the wood out, actually. I should have took the wood out at the end, but whatever. I mean, I've got a decent amount of wood anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and get all the stuff inside my furnaces now. And, uh, I don't know. If we, I mean, there's no way we'll know that I stole it, right? There's literally no way, so... Yeah, we are good to go. Let's go ahead and get this, uh, this shit running. Since I've got the blueprint as well, I'm gonna go f um, make a decent weapon, and I think I might just go try to kill them, honestly. Like, a lot of them are just running around the base. You heard the dude outside on the grass. The guy was building some more parts to the base, so I could just catch them when they're off, uh, off guard and just kill them all, probably. I mean, I had a pistol before and killed the dude who had an SMG, so, I mean, I was pretty decent. So, uh, we could get a custom SMG. I'd really want a Thompson, I think. Thompson's are pretty good, and we have, um, you know, enough bars to do that. I don't know. Oh, there's our bars right there. So, we've got enough to build that, so let's go and craft that, and then all we need is the pistol bullets, which I need some, uh, some gunpowder for, which is charcoal and sulfur, which I've got quite a lot of. It's pretty cool that people are trying to build walls inside bases, though. Like, I don't know if they can't put a roof over it or something, but it was a cool idea, but it is kind of um, a bit easy to uh, to get inside there. So, uh, where the fuck is the gunpowder? I don't even know. There it is. Okay, we found it. So, we can build a whole 35 gunpowder. I don't know how many bullets we can build from that. But I think you make two bullets per thing, so that should be like 70 bullets or something. Um, wait. No, we don't have any metal fragments. Okay, well, once we've got more metal fragments, we can build more. But you can see we've got a shit ton of ammo just from that. So we can go ahead and put away our revolver, this, and, and this is like, you know, this is more than enough ammo to keep us keep us good for now. So let's put us all away, and hopefully I won't get raided overnight. If I do, then rip me, but if not, then I've got a lot of good shit. I, I'm not sure if you need a large furnace to smelt this as well. I'm not sure if it smelts in a normal furnace or what, but yeah. Let's go drop all this stuff off and um, go try to... Do some stuff. I'm actually going to go get myself some armor as well if I can build it, which I think I've got the blueprint for. Some decent armor. We could get a kilt. I don't know. All this kind of sucks stick, but I... Yeah, actually, fuck it. We don't need it. Let's just go, um... Go do... 
do something with what I've got right now. We'll just go back and, and see what's up, you know? But if you guys haven't been following my, like, update videos, there has been a lot of stuff added in the recent updates. Like, that thing you want to see just says, new, the small oil refinery. Like, there's a shit ton of new stuff. And I don't actually get how Rust is so unpopular. I think it, I said it before in my Battle Royale video, but no one watched that. Because who the fuck wants to watch Battle Royale, apparently? Um, but, you know, Russia should totally be more popular. So, you should definitely check it out, you know? You know? Alright, let's go for a fucking door of explorer anyway. Got myself some bandages. All I need now is like a... Oh shit, you can see they've like upgraded their base. We've got like these little windows over here right there. But yeah, I need some, some better um, things to destroy shit with. Like, um... Like, uh, pickaxes and whatnot. But I can get that pretty easy from just killing someone. But you can see the dude is right inside there. Inside his newly built portion of the base. And that furnace room right there as well. You can see it's like a completely separate uh, part compared to the rest of the base. So, yeah, I don't know if there's a decent chance of him coming back or what, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna crouch over and just try to catch him off guard. There's a decent chance I'm gonna get fucked, but, eh, I tried. Let's go and turn off chat as well, so I don't need to see Ebola. So let's crouch around, sneaky peeky. I really like that they changed it so that you can't hear people in the crouching, because it makes fucking stealth warfare so much better. I mean, you couldn't do it before, and now you can. So we're gonna just crouch up, slowly but surely. Don't know how long it's gonna be until they realize that the entire work... Like, that's a lot of ore right there. I don't know how it's going to be until they realize that's all gone. But when they realize that, they're going to be kind of sad. Alright, so we should be getting, like, right on top of the base right now. I'm just going to wait until he opens up a door. And hopefully he won't hear me. Like, I don't know. Let's jump up on here. And then the base, the front door is right here. I think. I'm not sure, I can't really remember. Alright, let's try not to be too fucking obvious here. <laughs> Shit, the door's right there. I think I might have downed that guy, I don't know, I shot him a fuck ton. So this is like a cave base right here. I don't know where the fuck these guys are going. I'm not sure if I've got like multiple entrances or what, but yeah. Look at my base right up on top of a hill. Looks so good. That's what these guys are missing. I don't know why they're building the canyon. It's kind of, it's bad. It makes it really easy to attack. I mean, not that mine's like fucking impenetrable and it's definitely going to get destroyed overnight, but you know, I can always build another one, right? In fact, saying that, these guys' base is probably going to last more than one night, so I guess it is better than mine. When you think about it like that. There's, there's a decent amount of people in here. There's definitely more than one, I'll tell you that much. And they're gonna know I'm still here. But, yeah, I don't know. I've seen it outgun them, which I'm probably not gonna do. I don't know how that guy didn't die either. I shot him in, like, a head a bunch of times, but yeah. I'm just gonna work out exactly how this base works, and then I can do something to it. Oh, shit. Fucking shooting bow and arrow as well. Right, let's just get beside the front door, and that way, as soon as we open up the front door, I can just fucking shoot them. I think it's an okay plan. I'm not sure if they can see me if you look outside the window. And there's an arrow right there. Oh my god, I'm so scared. There's a dude up on the hill right there as well. Oh my god, there's three people going to my base? What the fuck is that? Holy shit, oh my god, I need to get home right now. Oh my god, I don't know if I can, I, can I slash home again? I don't know if I can, but it's fucking... Oh my god, it's on cooldown. I need to get to my fucking base right now. No! <sighs> friendly, friendly, friendly in Cherno. Alright, this is good and bad. It means that I can respawn in my bed, but I think this is going to be not only the fucking... What do you want, Lewis? I, d I don't want anything, man. I just want love. Uh, please help me. There's people attacking my base. I need help. I I'll, I'll, it can, we can make a tree speedy. Just pick me up, please. I'm on the floor. I'm on the floor. I'm going to die. Is that what I just said? Yeah. Shut the fuck up, dude. I'm in a peace tree, man. <laughs> the fucking message was not conveyed right because I said peace. Uh, tree speedy. Shut up, dude. Fucking, why are you listening? Alright, anyway, there's people- Yo, hello? There's people outside my base, probably, like, inside my base, ready to fucking kill my mum in a second, so... I've got, like, fucking... I don't know what to do, man. All I've got is pants and a dream. 
Oh my god. Or oh, maybe they didn't attack my base. I really don't know. 